वेलकम बैक टू चल गाइज वेलकम बैक टू दी अनदर वीडियो आई वॉज ट्वेंटी सिक्स पॉइंट वन पब्लिक बेटा फोर इज ओवर हेयर नाउ इट इज सेम एज डेवलपर बेटा फोर आई डिट दैट वीडियो ना वाई आई एम मेकिंग अनदर वीडियो दैट इज प्रोडी मच सेम एज डेवलपर बेटा फोर बिकॉज मैनी पीपल ओनली केयर अबाउट द पब्लिक बेटा दे डोंट गो फॉर द डेवलपर बेटाज दे जस्ट वेट फॉर द पब्लिक बेटा सो दिस वीडियो इज एक्चुअली फॉर दोज पीपल सो विदाउट एनी फर्दर डिले let's get jump into this video and see what is new and finally we can now do a lot with this liquid glass basically when you get into settings get into the display brightness now you have a all new brand new option over here that is liquid glass and now you can choose your liquid glass you can choose the clear option and choose the another one that is a tinted option now tinted options feels like a frosted glass being very honest and the clear one feels like the actual liquid glass and there's a big difference if i able to show you that how the both are different like now as you can see i choose the clear option and let me get into the apple podcast and let's see you know just bring it um bring it over here just to you know give you an option this is how it is looking like as you can see i hope it you are looking clearly at this that with the setup this is how it looks like this is the liquid glass clear option and when i go and choose the tinted one now this is how it looks like this is the tinted one again the clear one the tinted one a big difference and it is your choice that which you prefer and if you like the tinted one or you want to go with the you know the liquid one clear one actually so it is completely your choice but finally the choice is over here it will be better if they give us some toggle just slider something like that not a toggle slider actually it will be better but this is what it is and now finally if you go back from here and go all the way down over here into the display zoom they also updated these wallpapers over here but as you can see the i message is the older one i hope they will update that soon but over here the wallpapers are updated which is a good thing also a big thing that i really like you know we all know that we accidentally open camera always like swiping up we always accidentally open the camera but now it is not opening why it is not opening okay so when you get into the settings and you go to the camera go all the way down now there is a new toggle lock a screen swipe to open camera when this is on you can you know just put you can swipe this to get a camera but when this is off you cannot do this this is a big thing and it is going to be very useful um let me know in the comments that are you going to keep it turn off because i'm going to turn it off because there are like different ways to open the camera there is a camera um camera control button also available so that is what i always use to open the camera so yeah that is going to be a really 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 useful this toggle is really useful Also when you are into the Apple intelligence first of all you will not see the beta over here they remove the beta there is nothing new with the Apple intelligence i don't know why they remove the beta and also now the whole you know information on the top is left in aligned instead of a center line that is also a nice change when you go and you go to the phone app there is a new thing basically a toggle not a new thing it was available with the iOS 6 now you can turn off or on the haptic like whenever someone pick your call or drop your call it gives you a haptic this is a very small thing honestly but i don't know if you guys know or not this is a very very useful so i just keep it on because it's quite useful now in previous beta like in the beta 3 public beta 3 we got a swipe to stop the alarm if you remember that well you can also choose between if you want to swipe or you want a stop button this was like a beta 3 feature i missed that so i'm showing you again you can get into touch go all the way down and over here you will see prefer single act single touch actions if you want a stop button for alarm you can use stop if you prefer a swipe you can turn it off so this is another option available so far these are some of the features that are available with the iOS 6.1 public beta 4 things are decent things are working nice i also did a 24 hour review video of battery life and performance if you have a check that video go to my channel and check out that video 
and the next beta we are expecting an rc update i believe the next will be rc update i will be you know making a whole another video about that that's all from this video i hope to catch you guys in my next video until that take care peace out